Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. He's best known for his role as the Notorious B.I.G. in the blockbuster biopic Notorious. This rapper slash this rapper slash actor has been a force on the big screen. And with films like Barbershop, The Next Cut, and All Eyes on Me under his belt, he's enlarging his footprint in film with his newest project, Jug Gone Wrong. Please welcome Jamal Woolard. <laughs> 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 Jamal. All right. Great. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How you doing? How are you? Everything good. Yeah, Have a seat. Yeah, yeah. You can't play B.I.G. no more. You got skin tea on. Yeah. What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, you, you been drinking skin tea? Nah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What you got? Go on. Just trying to take care of myself. Yeah. yeah. I love my daughter to death, so I'm trying to live a long time. Yeah. All right. So you yeah. changed your eating habits? You got into a workout uh, regimen? What happened? A little workout. I don't need to do better. I okay. can do better. We okay. can all do better. Well, you fooling me then. If <laughs> you did. Appreciate it. Appreciate you did get skinny, didn't you? Yeah, you did. I mean, because you're doing a lot of great things right now. But let me <laughs> ask you a, a real quick question, because people look at you and they know you for Notorious B.I.G. Mm -hmm. right. So do you feel yourself getting typecasted after you've done that movie? No. Um, I just think I did a, a great job with embodying the role. You did. And when you do that, it's just like uh, being Arnold for different strokes, you know what I'm saying? He'll always be, you know, a little Arnold. Uh, but uh, when Ice Cube gave me a shot at Barbershop, that was wonderful. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That was different. You know, Marquise was a whole different actor. So it's just about working. Well, well now, speaking of working, you're doing uh, Jug Gone Wrong. Yeah, Jug Gone Wrong, my director Quest, great guy, gave me a shot. Yeah. And I played Big Man. What attracted you to this movie? Um, street stuff, you know, I'm from Brooklyn, it's easy to do street things, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ah, ah. Yeah, it's easy to, you know. I wasn't expecting that answer. Yeah. I, I wasn't either, yeah. I wasn't either. <laughs> yeah, Brooklyn, New York, so you know, that's what we do. Okay, mm. so how do you identify with it, though? Um, it was good, I mean, the character, it's about two cousins who do a hustle, mm -hmm. who do a jug, mm -hmm. you know, in Atlanta, you know. What is that, like a, is that what, like is like that a what jug means? Caper. Jug means hustle? Yeah, it means it's robbery. Like a, it's like a caper, It right? means robbery. Yeah, like okay. when you mm. go do a jug. Okay. Okay. Do a okay. stick up. Okay. You know? Okay. You do a yeah. kick door. See yeah. where I'm but from. But they want, <laughs> yeah, something like yeah. that. But they want to taking my money. Oh. So you got to pay, big man. When you take somebody money, you got to pay. You know. Yeah. Got okay. to pay that price. Pay it back. Oh. So, 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 how did you stretch yourself in this role, and how does this role playing this character different from others you've done already? In the I past? mean, I think every role you play is a different character. You know, I play many diverse characters, and you know, I'm a funny dude. Mm -hmm. So, uh, <laughs> if you do say so yourself, yes. no, nah, I'm, I'm a comedian. I'm goofy, you say but you know, <laughs> but um, every character you want to play something else. Just like uh, we're working on another film, uh, November mm -hmm. uh, Fifty Shots. Mm. It's about uh, Sean Bell, mm. the Sean Bell story when the guy got killed. So I'm playing his right hand man. Oh wow! So it's just transitions, uh, working the muscle, memorization. I rap. You know, I've been rapping for a long time, mm -hmm. so they call me Gravy. So my memorization from rap and script is the same thing. It's just oh, delivered different. Right but now. memorization, when people be like, when I was working on the tours with Angela Bassett, like, how you remember it so fast? It's already stored from rap. You know, I was rapping since sense. I was yeah. 17, 18. I'm 44. You, me, you me too. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Al, yeah, <laughs> Wow, so, so you, you, know. you also worked with Clifton Powell. How was it oh, working man. with him? He that's the OG. Uh, yeah. That's the OG. So my man Quest, the director, had gave him a um, Lifetime Achievement Award, and that was beautiful. I cried on that thing. Because mm -hmm. I felt like he deserves, he's an underdog, mm -hmm. but he's just as big as everybody else. Mm -hmm. Denzel, Sam, he's just as big and just as talented. He just uh, takes all the jobs like I do. Cause I get the same pressure he get with, you know, taking jobs. Why, why are you taking that low budget film? Why are you doing this? Why, you, man, work is work. Mm. But do you feel like it waters you down in a sense where if you're gonna take a job, right, or mm -hmm. a, a project that's gonna probably pay three hundred thousand, then it's gonna be challenging for you to go up to a, a, a project that's gonna pay a million. And then why would you come back down to take another three hundred thousand after the meal ticket? Well, at the end of the day, it's about the craft. It ain't really about the money. If you worry yeah. about the money, you are gonna be long wait. You be sitting there forever. You better yet. If you think every movie's gonna be big as Notorious, you got another thing coming. You just gotta work. That's it, just work, and it, it come to you. Let God uh, direct. Just let him do mm -hmm. his thing. You know what I'm saying? God is the real director. That, you know that's right. Right, right now, so that's what we So, at. you were talking before about you being a rapper. Your name is Gravy, because you got that flow. Hey, so hey. So Gravy, hey. Let me ask you a question, though. Uh, Music or movies? Mm. Tell me why, tell me why. I mm, love them both. That's After good. You but which one, though? If you had to choose, <laughs> somebody got the gun to your head right now. You got to choose. Music Wait a minute, why so harsh? It's so harsh. Okay, now tell me why it would be movies. It's a bigger check. 
<laughs> I mean, I got a lot of you. It's a, it's a bigger check. Yeah. So you said movies. Yeah, it'd be right. movies. Describe your musical style if you can. Oh, uh, I'm smooth as Jay Z, hard as pop, and some even say I remind him of Biggie. Oh, okay. I thought you was about to give me a whole no, sixteen gave, right now. Let's get you three. <laughs> get you three. All right, all right. So tell us, what is next for you? Just, just living life, just uh, working, getting big roles. You know, just keep running, keep running. So, like after after Jug, what do you what do you oh, have? Oh, Sean going Bell, right Sean Bell, and Sean Bell. Nothing the else Sean after Bell that. You work on an album. Uh, music got a hold on. I'm trying to pull a Jamie Foxx because mm -hmm. remember Jamie dropped first and the album did. Mm -hmm. Then he did Living Color. Then yeah. he did Ray. Then he yeah. dropped. So mm -hmm. sometimes it's about the setup. Mm -hmm. So right now let me just get some some joints under my feet. Yeah. yeah. I got 20, 30 movies. Then I, I drop yeah, some. I, mm -hmm. I have to be honest. With, as a, a fellow actress. I feel like you embodied that role all Appreciate the way. You didn't see you. We saw Biggie yeah. the whole way Appreciate through. So that was absolutely amazing. But thank you so much that. for joining us. Thank, thank you for always having welcome me. down to the circle. Absolutely. And you can catch Jamal and the amazing cast of Jug Gone Wrong. And be sure to download the movie right now on Amazon or iTunes or Google Play.